No cold, no wind, no snow, not a problem. This is skiing without the constraints of the weather. I like doing jumps and stuff like that on it. Yeah, it's pretty real actually. Yeah, it seems like a real thing. What we're really about is not taking people away from the slopes. What we're, the advantages are is giving families and people the introduction uh, to skiing in a really safe and warm environment. So when they do get to the mountain, their experience is going to be a lot better. The huge incline treadmills have become popular in Europe and make for an infinite ski run. The skis and snowboards glide on a lubricated astroturf and because the skier can remain stationary, beginners learn with the support of a balance bar. If you are a technical good skier, you don't have problems with it. It takes you about 50 minutes to half an hour to get used to it. If you are, you know, like just a not proper technique, it's going to be more difficult. Instructors carry a remote control to stop the run if the inevitable happens. Well, and it doesn't hurt nearly as much, so yeah. With no snow, it means there are no chunky parkas, scarves or beanies. And that means you don't have to look ridiculous while you ski. It is Australia's first urban skiing centre, but it probably won't be the last. The company wants to open in Sydney within a year. Sort of what outdoor rock climbing was, now indoor rock climbing is just such a popular sport. We're looking to make outdoor skiing um, come into our centres so, so people can have it all year round. This was just a dummy run. The centre hopes to open to customers next month. Guy Stainer, ABC News, Melbourne.